It is the 15th of the 5th, 2012. This is today's climate change update. Well, let's go ahead and get started on SOT.net. Not a lot going on tonight. Three forest fires burning out of control in Alberta, Canada. A fire ban is in effect as firefighters worked around the clock on three forest fires burning out of control in northern Alberta. Officials are issued fire ban on Monday for most forested area in the province. And they're having uh, to deal with the after effects of crazy weather up there. First time in 50 years, snow hits Bosnian capital, Sarajevo. The Bosnian capital and its surroundings were covered by snow on Monday. The first time in half a century, snow has settled in Sarajevo at this time of the year, as temperatures plunge into just above freezing. And of course it continues. Pacific Mystery. What's killing the dolphins and pelicans off the coast of South America? Uh, just what is killing the, all the dolphins and pelicans? And what has chased all the fish away? It's been a mystery for months on the Pacific coast of Peru where local government says it has found 900 dolphin carcasses and something like 4,500 pelicans and it's been bad enough that this country's health ministry has ordered 1,500 miles of beaches closed. And while it may all seem very far away from the United States, scientists from around the world have been watching. And so it's still a big mystery. Uh, nobody's fessing up what's going on. And a lot of people are pointing their fingers at the oil industry. Uh, and we got a 6.2 earthquake in Chile. And that's about all new they've got going on tonight. Over the RSOE, uh, I just wanted to cover one story. You've got a nuclear event in the United Kingdom in Scotland. Uh, the Torness Power Station, one of its reactors was shut down. Um, they are not explaining why the reactor shut down, but of course they're saying there's no threat to the public. And this reactor was supposed to be shut for uh, shut down for normal repairs and whatever on the 19th. So they're going to go ahead and start that early since the, the reactor decided to trip itself for some strange reason. Uh, over to any news, the nuclear stuff. Shock, question mark. NHK or chairman named it to TEPCO board of directors. Well, there's a big surprise. Doctor, did Japan raise radiation limits, quote, to keep people calm while they were being poisoned, unquote? Uh, you know they were. Magazine headlines, radioactive black dust striking Tokyo metropolitan area. I've been told it's everywhere in the city, says reporter. What is this mysterious black dust? Japan physicians, one million will develop cancer and die from Fukushima radiation using expert figures, which are extremely, extremely cushioned and low. Uh, cesium spike in Tokyo Bay is, quote, no immediate threat to health. Fukushima containment increases up 1,200% since August. Levels will continue to rise for years. What they're not telling you is they're dumping all the ash that they're burning in the open incinerators into Tokyo Harbor uh, for final disposal. And you wonder why the cesium levels are going through the roof. Uh... Michio Kaiku, the Chernobyl core is still melting into the earth. May yet hit groundwater and create steam explosion. So Michio Kaiku saying uh, Chernobyl is far from over, of course. And uh, we never know what's going to happen. And... Yeah, that's about it. New they've got going on today and uh, that's about all I've got new going on today now I do want to finish off with uh, letting Skybird Bird know that I did get your package uh, thank you it was unnecessary um, she sent me a silver let's see if I can get that on the camera right a silver pin it's a Mayan calendar long count beautiful piece and of course the sauce I will enjoy the sauce and um, yeah thank you thank you very much I enjoyed doing your sculpture I hope it uh, it stays with you for a very long time enjoy what you can everybody thanks